Yarra Stadium, the venue this afternoon is round four of the Bunnings NPC continues. Taranaki looking to remain undefeated at the top of the table against the Bay of Plenty side, hunting their second win of the season. Joining me in commentary this afternoon, a man who spent four seasons with the Bay, one of our kilted Kiwis, former Scotland international, Hugh Blake. Good to see you, Hugh. Yeah, g'day, Jeff. Today is going to be a classic battle of North Island rugby. Taranaki versus Bay of Plenty always promises to, to deliver a high octane footy. A few tweaks to the Taranaki side that picked up a bonus point win against Waka till Ricky Riccatelli, Ruben O'Neill come in up front this week for Bradley Slater and Michael Bent. Captain Kalen Boshe moves to number eight with Peter Garcia Cooler named on the blind side. Adam Lennox will start in the number nine jersey alongside Stephen Perofeta, who shifts from fullback to first five. Matty McKenzie gets the nod at fullback this week. Former Bay of Plenty lock Tom Franklin has answered an SOS from Neil Barnes and will make his debut off of the bench. Well, just a couple of changes for Bay of Plenty this week after their round three loss to County's Monaco. Kurt Eklund again captains the Bay in the front row alongside Aidan Ross and John Alfour. The only change in the pack with Vinny Lasanga in on the open side for Semisi Pire and a loose forward combo with Naitoa Akoi and Nikora Broughton. Titoro Taurirangi again links with the talented Lucas Cashmore, Lalo Milo providing power in midfield. Only change in the backs this week sees the return from injury for All Black Seven speeds the Leroy Carter on the right wing. They have plenty coached by Richard Watt. Taurirangi, John Afua, yep, this looks a very short pass to Viveni Lasanga. Yes, Wanting some support here, Titoroa. And uh, I just said again, right in front of the post, Sangster, big hit coming in. Tom Florence, good contact by the Taranaki open side. Here's an opportunity though, floating the ball wide. Naruhi Mugabe Black has scored the try. Brilliant finish in the corner. And it's the Bay on the ball first in New Plymouth. Taranaki looked to build down the right through Mehana Grinlay. Hanati wants it. And he drops a lovely little pass off too to his hooker. And Ricky Riccatelli no, you're long. is uh, 12 metres out from Bayer Pliny's line. Pedro Fetter. Excellent try. Stephen Pedro Fetter. We see great forward link play be between Pareti and Ricky Riccatelli. Here we've got Kalen Bosch here, another out the back ball, Florence Short, great interplay between the Fords and Blacks. Peter Fetter straight through the middle, untouched. Great try. Lovely ball at the back, Kalen Bosch. Well, he scored for himself this season. Kurt Eklund oh, looked to plug in at the back of the Bay Mall here. That's one by Nikora brought in. Over the 15. Seven, Mugabe, Black going seven. in as well. To add his weight, it's there with Eklund, is it? Yes, he's got his hands on it. They've got another advantage. Close to the line here, Eklund, and he scores! Excellent work off the line out, and Bay of Plenty have their second. Now, we'll just be aware because we're starting to get a few wrecked up. Well, doing to Taranaki what they've been doing to sites all season. Yeah. And plenty of weight in there, too. Backs coming in to join the party. Yep. Selby Rickett. Go low again on the big lock forward. Lalo Milo wants his hands on it. There it is, Cashmore stepping off the right. And taking the ground is Riccatelli. So good defence for the time being here on the home side. Will it hold? Sangster. Good aggressive direct run straight into him with Paul Cunningham. Tauri Orangi just held the pass slightly. Going for two. Narohi Mugabe Black strong. Brilliant try. What a finish again in that left-hand corner. And he gets his second for the afternoon. I feel if they can just stay in this till the half. Maybe get some more points. He's right in it. After an Barnes rev up at half time. Kenny Nohola breaking the line. Kenny Nohola, brilliant. How about the swim? Has he got the power to get there? Yes, he does. That is how you respond with one of your strike weapons, Kenny Nohola. Individual brilliance, great footwork, big fend. One on one with the fullback, backs himself to go on the outside. Great individual try, Kenny Nahola. Taranaki, if they can plug this down inside the corner to even things up, and they take that. 
trying to get the distance again. Oh, the ball's not out again. So the crowd, you can hear them. Cole Forbes feels it. Taranaki will still have possession. That's a couple of okay? Excellent work. Oh, there we go. Haditi drops it off. Kenny Nahola. Lovely run. In support. Kenny Nahola looking for two. Just short. Reach in. Taurangi Warden's there. As Jim Karen wants a look. How about that yeah. break? Another so one. So at the moment, I've got an on field try. I've got the ball on the line grounded. Can we just see how he's got it there, whether it's a double movement or whether it's a placement onto the line? Yeah. Yeah. I, I okay. Back. So he's, got, he's short, but then he's yeah. placed the ball, which, which he's allowed to do. So there's no clear double That's movement. The best angle. So it's going to be a try here. And it's a try. <laughs> Tries awarded. Kenny Nolo has turned things around. Cashmore, Malani, Nanai fires the ball away to the two try scorer. Ngarui Magavi Black puts that a kick trying. through. There it is for Pedro Feta, who. Just takes it into touch and says, that'll do us. An entertaining first half of rugby here at Yarrow Stadium. And at halftime, it is 19 points apiece. Taranaki and Bay of Plenty. Peter Gassaikula lurking in Taranaki's midfield. Pariti decides to play it down the short side. He breaks through. Jesse Pariti, he's got players in support. Riccatelli just can't hold on. To be fair, it was bootlaced stuff. Very, very difficult. But an excellent break by the Taranaki lock forward. He sinks it really well there. Shut down the pass and then put it straight through. Good feel. He didn't look on the inside. Ricky Riccatelli down the outside. Taranaki Sally Rickett. Clean take. For the Marty All Black. Got an advantage too here. Collapsing of the lineup. I think it's Conan Bosch here who's uh, being pinged by Stu Curran. So Cashmore I looked to play it deep. Kenny Nola was flying up, but they're under advantage here as uh, Carter sends it downtown. He's got all the skills. Carter! And he's going to score the tries. Yes! Stunning finish. Leroy Carter. They had a penalty advantage, which gave Leroy Carter the opportunity to have a crack, do something a little different. Just great resilience. Followed it up. The bounce of the ball and try time. Deserves it after the first half he had. First half he had. Great work, Leroy Carter. Now he goes. I thought about going blind. As Cole Forbes no, just dabs a week ago over the top. Still playing advantage. And so Ben Akumiroa on the park. This powerful front row forward is Lalomilo. Lalomilo, Carter this time. Trying to play distributor for his captain. Very close, Eklund. They're going to score on that. Oh, no. Just goes forward. Mugabe Black created that ill discipline at the breakdown too, which gave Cole Forbes the opportunity to have a chip kick. Great backing up from the prop, Bene. Kurt Eklund in the wide channels. Just a little bit of skill execution in there to finish. Otherwise, it would have been a try all day for Bay Just holds it up, pedal Feta. The no-look pass. But up to Matavuki Nevkins. Huge contact. And Lalo Milo, Lalo Milo has come off worse for wear there. Some contact and a bit of concern too on this near touch. A big step inside. Lalo Milo, Lalo Milo. You know, he's got good intention, but he's tackle. gone in a little bit too high. Possible shoulder to head. Potential shoulder to head. So we've got direct head contact, but there is a late change of direction, OK? So it's going to decrease it to just a yellow card. Well, he's the one be a penalty here. Who, uh, who copped it. Lalo Milo, Lalo Milo. And it's good to see him on his feet. And that is where the game is at at the moment. Is he over an HIA anyway? Stu Karen talked about a mitigating factor. He was slightly changing direction, so we'll it is a yellow card. Cole Forbes, Judd. It was over the 15. The Bay of Plenty line out. Here's Judd. And the Steamers will look to try and wrap this one up. Kick coming through. He's been exceptional. Narohi Mugabe Black coming across in cover. Pedal Feta. 
and cool as you like. Stephen Perofeta, just like he was having a casual stroll at the park. And Taranaki have it, four out. Use it. Still trying to fight their way back, trailing by seven. Potros dangerous in the end goal. And there isn't much more that Jacob Ratamaitavuki Nidkins can do. Plenty of space down the short side. He's got an advantage to to work with Nathan Vella. Brought down three out. Richard Judd organising the troops. Wanga dishes it away. Broaden again. Tanaki asked to make plenty of tackles as they've had to do all afternoon. They've got another offside advantage to work with. Very, very close here. Once more, Judd digs in. They go back to the right penalty, though. The I guess Cashmore. Opportunity to put it beyond doubt. Which he has done. So, rolling the dice. Peter Gassoakula has got it. It'd be very hard to stop. Florence, Tom Florence Hands rolls his sleeves up. There for Sonny Devin, they've got an advantage. Very close to the line. Taranaki looking for more. They're over, they score. Michael Bent, the veteran. But yeah, as we see here, Peter Gus around the corner, running hard and then some good patience from Taranaki. Finished on a high, take some momentum into next week. Grabbing that bonus point in the last minute of the game. As Pedal Feta sends it through. An excellent game of rugby. A big performance by Bay of Plenty, who have their second win of the season. 29 points to 26 here tonight over Taranaki.